Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. So, I don't actually think I vlogged yesterday. Um, I had to go up to Erie yesterday. Tim wanted me to do something up there. Um, I'm not gonna get into that because that was just stressful and a half the entire time. Um, and then I stopped at Carter's, got her a few more pieces. I'll show you guys that. Um, because she got the $25 credit or gift card for um, Carter's while we were, like, for her birthday. So we went up and spent that. Um, there's someone just sitting at the end of our drive here. Okay, not sure what that was about. But um, I just got back from Dollar General, so... I went over for two things, came back with like five things, well, more than that, but um, I went over to get myself and Ella something for lunch um, because I haven't been able to go grocery shopping because Walmart, last time I was there, they were like wiped of everything because like food stamps had come in for our location or whatever, and so Walmart had like next to nothing. Um, and then I also stopped yesterday when I was at Target um, and got three pairs of pants. Only one of the three pairs fit. Even though they're all the same size. Same style, pretty much. Only, like, these are like a stretch yoga type. Like, athletic type yoga. Um, and they're the ones that flare at the bottom. But the other two are ones that, like, are tight. Like, skinny jean type. Tight at the ankle. And they don't fit. So, I'm going to have to return those next time I go up that way. But... Over at Dollar General, I ended up picking up two of these pregnancy tests. Just because, I don't know, I've been feeling weird. Like, my body's been being weird these last couple of days. And I plan on testing here in a day or two just to confirm. Because so far, the Provera hasn't kick-started my period. So, I don't know what's going on. Um, and then I got this Snapple. It's a new flavor I wanted to try. It's a watermelon lemonade. Um, so I got that to try uh, over because I needed aluminum foil because my brother-in-law at her birthday for the grill, he used the last of our aluminum foil. So I picked up some more of that and then I grabbed these. I used to love these when I was in high school. Um, I used to survive on these. Me and my friend would go in every week to our little store and they were only like a dollar or... I think they were like 50 cents or something like that. They were real cheap. Um, and me and my friend would go into the store and we would buy out all that they had. And that was like 12 each. Um, and we did that every week. So they're the Venom energy drinks. Um, I don't remember if I've ever had the mango. I think I have though. And I used, I think I used to like it. Uh, but then they have like black mambo, which is the red, and then they have an orange, I don't remember the flavor, and then they have a purple of that flavor, but I don't, or, or purple color of that flavor too. But I ended up picking up two of the mango, one for me and one for Tim, because Tim likes mango. I don't think he's ever had the Venom energy drink, so I picked those up. Um, and then I grabbed some Cheez-Its. For Ella and I, I grabbed these D'Italiano steak rolls. Or these are, and yeah, they're steak rolls. Um, and I got these for dinner tonight because I'm making um, steak -um sandwiches. So got those for dinner. And then I ended up picking up a four pack of drumsticks for myself. A pint. Is this a pint? One and a half quarts, I guess, of Butterfinger ice cream for Tim. Um, I asked him if he wanted to try it, and he said, yeah, so I got that. And then I got some pizza rolls. This is what I'm having, um, and Ella's going to have a few of these, too, and then we're going to have some Cheez-Its on the side. That's our lunch. And then from Carter's, show you guys, I got, I ended up spending only $23. The gift card was for $25. Um, the rest of that money, I just told them to use the, the last $2 towards the next purchase. Um, just because what's $2 going to get me? 
but two dollars might help someone else out if that makes sense um so i got her a couple of pairs of pants and an outfit set the one outfit set i wanted to get her they didn't have in her size um and she's like well we can order it from the warehouse and ship it to your house for free just because we don't have that size i'm like okay that that's fine like yeah that's what i'll do and then i'll get these two pairs of pants today and then that other outfit will come to my um, house and she checked the warehouse on her little computer and they didn't have any of that outfit in 18 months and i was heartbroken like that outfit was so cute it had the ruffle butts and everything which was adorable but they didn't have it so i got her this set it has a little owl on the butt of the pants and then it's got the this long sleeve onesie with it it's just a little floral onesie and then it's got this long sleeve onesie with it and it's just got a deer and an two owls the owl says root for some reason but yeah I got her those um and a lot of people ask me they're like well aren't you potty training or gonna be potty training why aren't you or why are you still buying onesies and that's a very good question and for me I absolutely hate when I'm getting her out of the car or carrying her into a store especially in the dead of winter summertime didn't really bother me that much because you know it's hot but in the summer in the winter time when it's frigid cold and i'm trying to get into the store as quick as possible because i don't want to stand there get her out of her car seat fumble to get a jacket on her take it off when we get into the store and then put it back on before we get into the store out of the store and then take it back off when we get to the car we just don't put a jacket on her unless she like unless it's a really thin um like jacket over a short sleeve shirt um so i just i don't like whenever we're dead of winter if she's in a t-shirt and her t-shirt rides up and makes her bare belly show i don't like that so the onesies whenever we start potty training i'll leave them unbuttoned throughout the day unless we're out um but like around the house or whatever she can be in a onesie but it'll be unbuttoned and then if we were to go out i can button it up real quick so that her skin's not showing i really hope that makes sense to you guys um and then i got her these cute these are i think leggings but they're a hot pink with little apples all over them i love these pants I wish they made a shirt in this pattern because I'd have totally bought that entire outfit. Um, and then I got these pants. So the short or the shirt that I was gonna get to go with these, the smallest size they had was 2T. So I got her these spooky pants, is what I call them. They've got little uh, pumpkins, ghosts, hearts, candy corn, eyeballs, pieces of the candy. It says boo oh excuse me that type of thing and don't shoot the messenger but tim pointed this out to me he last night and i was like you know what that is so true so this little ghost that's upside down on the pants it kind of looks like groot from guardians of the galaxy i just thought that was really cute they also have little kittens and stuff like that on them so that's what I got for her from Carter's with her Carter's gift card that she got for her birthday. Um, all 18 months. Now I need to get this ice cream and everything put away. Get Ella and I some food because I can. I, I know I'm starving. She's eaten today. I haven't, but I am hungry. So I'm going to sit down and eat. But I just edited her birthday vlog. So that should be up today, which is the 17th. So yeah.